Hello everyone, my name's Nisha and I am the Yoga Gymnasiac. We're back. I ran a few steps forward from the last episode and we're gonna go get Kinsey Kensington. I think that's her name. Kinsey Kensington, something like that. Um, on the barge up here in the ocean, the Kilbane and the Syndicate just attacked Johnny's funeral in the last episode for a quick recap. If it wasn't clear also, I think it might not always be clear, but um, yeah, they attacked the saints at Johnny Gat's funeral, and Sean B was super not okay with that. This is another episode or thing you could do super fast. I highly recommend jumping the boat on. You will warp out if you cannot get out of your thing. That was record big air. Okay, how am I supposed Looks to Looks like get? the bleak line by Christoph Valkyrie. What? You found there the fab yet? The bleak line by Christoph Valkyrie. Hey, yeah, they have swords. Kinsey's dead before she's yours. Kinsey's dead before she's yours. I'm guessing you're Kinsey Kensington? Yep. Kensington. You don't seem that excited about being rescued. I'm waiting to see if you were sent to kill me. Girl's pragmatic. I like her. How do I untie her? It's not letting me untie her. Did I get here too? Okay. I guess you just have to be on the other side of her. Somebody cover me. And, uh... So what do you want with me? You don't look like feds. We heard that you know some people who hate the syndicate as much as we do. That's the whole mission. So, um, if you well, jump the off, are keeping Zemos at safe yeah. Translation, please. The De Winters are the twin sisters that run prostitution in Steelport. Zemos was their competition, so the sisters locked him up. And Safe Word is just a BDSM club that caters to various acts of perversion. The name comes from Ho Ah, we got it. Mine's Teacup. I'll get her out of here. <laughs> Have fun at the Gimp Show. I like how the way she cuts off is like really awkward and like <laughs> very clearly not interrupted. Anyway, uh, if you do the mission like that, it's really fast. I gotta say thanks for freeing me. You can thank me by finding a third person to help. I think I know someone who'd help, but I gotta find him first. I'll call you when I have a location. Anyway, yeah, that mission takes so much longer if you just get off the boat. What sort of kink they have at a place um, like this? At the I bottom. Look like I go to one of those clubs. I bet you'd be into some nasty shit if you tried it. Stop talking. Oh my god, you totally would. Shut up. The first time I played that mission, I stopped, got off, climbed onto the barge, ran all the way through shooting all these people, and it's very hard. Most of the times after that, I did exactly what I did today. This was the first time that I ramped it so perfectly. There's a lot of um, crates in the way. So you could hit a crate and land earlier, but if you hit that sweet spot, you, so where do we start you cruise looking? on through. Shake people down. Someone's gotta know where they're keeping our boy. This episode is not just rated R. This episode is straight up rated X and maybe add a couple more X's onto the end there because we're about to see some real dirty stuff. <laughs> anyway, ramp onto the barge. That's all I wanted to say. Either take me to Zemos or I'm gonna beat your sorry ass. <gasps> oh, yes! Seriously? Ugh. The manager's upstairs. He ain't no. Just take me. <sighs> I've been bad. Yeah, they like snap out of the animation. It's kind of weird. Anyway, there's lots of people dancing. And we're not going to spend too much time on that. <laughs> I'd like to avoid getting tagged for adult content. Is this the room we want to go in? Oh, this is. This, you know. There's a lot of really dirty stuff in here. The manager, where is he? I don't know anything. I'm just here for a bachelor party. Damn it. Okay, I think no matter who you go to. Oops, sorry, I meant to throw you off of the bed. No matter who you ask, they all they they'll say I'm here for a bachelor party. You're in the way, Pierce. Coming through. There we go. Maybe if you shoot him. There's some syndicate guys in here, so bring this thing down. Should have reloaded earlier. After that, I could use a massage. All right, hey, buddy. Zemos, where is he? Well, if I say anything, the De Winter sisters will cut me off. Funny, I was thinking of cutting something off too. 
He's in the pony barn. All right. What, There's porn on that TV over there, by the way. Just like old times. I'm just gonna use you as a shield. No, I'm not. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad I got video evidence of that. <laughs> you, you know what? Hold on. I am gonna run up and see if he's over here somewhere. Is there a room over here? Oh no, I can't go over there. Dang it. That's so funny. He's probably up whatever, wherever that is. Like, that must be another room. Okay, whatever. I'll run past you. This is another one. Oh, I always run up instead of down. Shoot your butt. Oh no, there he is. I guess he just flew through the wall. Hey, buddy. The rock. Whoa. Hey, guys. I still haven't bought more grenades and whatnot. Last time I did this, I had incendiary bullets, and that was actually kind of a nightmare. This place again? It'll be too soon. Oh, I'm gonna have to bathe in hand sanitizer. Don't worry. We'll get a box of that shit. Is incendiary the right word? How are we gonna find Zemos? Look for the cat in here who isn't excited to be eating a ball gag? Or just look for the guy with a rhinestone Z on his back. Fuck out of here, man. Oh, well, shit, that's convenient. They went this way. Uh, shit. <laughs> we don't got time, Zemos. Mush! Mush! Let's get this over with. The pony cart. So if you shoot the gimp in the front, um, they will explode like a car engine would. Let's see if I can get this guy to, to explode. There. <laughs> see? But sometimes it's faster just to shoot the people. No, no, no. I'll just... Yeah. I don't think it works that way. No? You just have to kill all three carts and you're good to go. I think you can shoot the people, you don't have to explode them. Sorry about making you, you know, pull us around. This is a rescue, right? <laughs> this ain't some elaborate setup for a gang bang. Why you gotta put that image in my head, bro? Oh, I'll go with rescue then. <laughs> I would shake your hands, but them floors were a little sticky if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm good. Find a moist towel let or something. Hit us up. I found the guy he was talking about. All right. His name's Angel de la Muerte. He was killed by his tag team partner until he went crazy. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm gonna cut you off there real quick. Oh, I don't know where there's a friendly fire over here. He will just... Who went crazy? Angel or Kilbane? I should probably look into that. The point is, Angel hates Kilbane more than you do. He should be willing to help. Got a location? Go That's first. the tricky part. The luchadors are attacking him at the gym right now. You should probably hurry before he gets killed. And that didn't come first. Why? You asked too many questions. I hurry up, you're on the clock. Oh, cool, there's friendly fire right here. Thanks, player. I appreciate you busting me out. You're welcome, and let's forget it ever happened. Yeah. Time to mount a rescue, Z. Don't the same mount. So no saddle up comments Ooh. either. If you didn't just bust me out, I'd be walking the other nice. way. Nice. Nice. Okay. I don't know how much I. I think you just inc earned yourself a incendiary bullets aren't for a while. Did I get them already? Last time I played this. Oh my God. Though an elevator was crushed during the fall, rescue workers were unable Whoopsie. to find the metal to determine if anyone was inside. The presence of what appeared to be a suggested the worst. At this time, city officials are uncertain how this new menace will be removed before more people find themselves crushed under its enormous weight. <laughs> this is your drama with your steel cord terror. Oh boy. Okay. 
Here we go. Okay. All that just to get back here. But I didn't fall off this time. That's what's important. You don't even know Gosh, I love Nightblade. It is my favorite character. <laughs> uh, maybe. Sometimes he's my favorite character. Other times, not so much. Whoopsie. Sorry. Josh Burke. That's the guy who was helping us with the heist, the method actor who had come to... Who had come to join us <laughs> and press the button that set off the alarm that called the SWAT team. Josh Burke. Lovely guy. Not really. Really annoying. It's fun to have him and Shandi together. Sorry, not sorry. Fight or shit. Do people actually say sorry, not sorry for real? Like, seriously? I guess some people do, but they're not like trying to be nice. When they say it, they're usually trying to be jerks. It's kind of like saying you do you, which everyone who hears me say that will know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> Oh my gosh. You do you is my favorite thing to say. But it's a running joke among me and some of my friends. Ooh. Okay, I'm pretty sure there's another big guy. And Pierce, or er, Zemos, died like 20 times last time I did this. Where is he? Can I just run him over? Nope. Get out of the car, get out of the car, get out of the car. Oh. There we go. No. You have to get really good at dodging these guys, and they can sprint like crazy. They're so fast. Gosh. Oh, I'm so close. Dang it. Okay. I don't know. I don't think that does any damage to them, though. Actually, maybe it did a little bit. I don't know. I'm up for more. I really need to learn the quick time events for all of these. Anyway, if you just take care of that, you'll notice Zemos takes care of most of these guys. And Angel is actually out here. Which there he is. Zemos, this is Oleg. Oh yes, Oleg is here. All right, now we can run inside to and actually party, beat I? Angel to the checkpoint. There's plenty to go around. Let's get in there and find Angel. <laughs> I was watching. Yeah, he was not in there. I was watching GDQ. You're not one of Lorenz brutes, and you are not one of Kilbin's luchadors. No, but they are. So I was watching GDQ runs today, so now I'm all like speed run out. Leave this imposter to me. Yeah, Oleg will take care of him, but you can do some damage, I think. Anyway. This is when incendiary bullets are really nice because they're all like ganged up to get Is that the correct word? I'm gonna have to go back and double check and make sure I'm saying the correct word. Child of mine. Just an abomination. Um, but this is where they're really nice because they're all like bunched up coming well. in the door together and you just light them on fire like one after the other. Also, there's a horde mode spelled W H O R E D, not H O A R D. Um, and you can do it here, but I don't think they give you incendiary <laughs> bullets. <laughs> Oh, Where is this homeboy? Come on, boy. You really have to I'll take care aim of this. for this guy's head. 
You say that, Oleg, but last time this guy was here, Angel died like 20 times before you did anything. The nice thing about these guys is they don't come really and run at you to like attack you. you go. Of course you died, and now I'm taking damage. So, you almost will never, if you remember, we had UAV drones at the beginning of the game. God damn it, Angel. Oh, like, you're not helping at all. Um, well, you got those UAV drones at the beginning of the game, and I literally never use them because you have to go hide in a corner somewhere. And, uh, people can still shoot you, and it's really a pain. Okay. Okay. Be careful, they have flamethrowers. Show beats dancing. So, like, you're actually gonna help us out? Ooh! There you are. Stay away from him. Oh, sorry, Angel. You fight with the strength That's of Achilles. That's what I'm talking about. Yep. So uh, that mission's pretty easy too, I guess. <laughs> I really feel like I could speed run this game well, without breaking and it. Gentlemen, Philippe is dead, and we are at a crossroads. And the question is, who will lead the syndicate to a new era? Viola and Kiki were Mr. Loren's right hands. I had someone else in mind. Excuse me? The Syndicate has to answer for what they did. And this time, we're taking the fight to them. Since we don't know Steelport, I brought in some people who do. This is Kinsey, Zemos, and Angel. The barbarians are at the gate! We need a general, not an ambassador! Calm down, Eddie. What? Did you call me? What would you like us to do, Kilbane? Something. Anything. Before I wonder why I keep you bookends around. Talk to one of these guys. They'll have things for you to do. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. Man, my character is a cutie. Hey, Pierce. Pierce is a cutie too, though. Angel's alright. Oh, that goose. And that's a hottie with a body. I hope you did just see that weapon. I have a friend who thought that was um, modded into the game. It is not. That is a real weapon that came with the game. It's actually pretty good. I don't have it. Okay. Uh. Oh, I can't pick it up anymore. Oh, that's fine. I'm not going to use it. Anyway, thank you so very much for watching. I think that's a good place to stop in this episode. Yeah, we'll get back to it in the next episode. From here on out, it's kind of... I, th I want to say there's, like, less cutscenes for a little while. So it'll be a lot more gameplay and a lot less cutscenes, which is nice. Anyway, That'll do it for this episode. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I will see you guys in the next video. Like my dad always said, if you can't beat him, join him, and then betray him in a horrible murder orgy. <laughs> okay.